We got a system that doesn't work. Can I fix it? Let's find out right now on Robitech. Well, we got a system that we built that got to the owner and uh, yeah, when the poor young child tried to turn it on, didn't actually work. After us spending a lot of time trying to shovel, troubleshoot it over the phone, we decided to go ahead and pay for it to get shipped back here. Uh, so we had them ship the box and the system back. We are going to be taking a look at it and seeing if we can figure out what actually is wrong with the system. And you know, figured we just do it live right here with you guys. So first and foremost, we got the GPU, which is he's getting zero signal. So he's turning on the PC. Uh, and they are getting no signal whatsoever. Now, first thing I'm gonna do is just get it down to its bare minimum. Uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead and strip down the PC. I don't see any damage or anything. Uh, oh, the actual clip is missing. So I'm gonna see if we can find the clip for the PCIe and see if we can get that in there. Oh, hey, I found it. Okay, so we got our clip back. There we go. Okay, clip's back on, so that's good. Hey, one problem fixed, yay! So let's look at the GPU. So looking at the GPU, no damage. Everything here looks normal and fine. There's no bending or anything like that. So let's just go ahead and get it in. Get this out of the way, we won't need that for a while. Move these back. Okay, nice solid snap there. Let's see if it actually boots. Okay, so we got power. No graphics whatsoever. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna turn it off and let's go grab another GPU and see if we get the same problem. So this is posting with this other GPU and you're seeing that right now. Let's go ahead and test this on a different system just to see if we're getting the same issue. Ugh. Might as well be thorough, but I am not seeing a post. Looks like a VGA light thing. Just to be safe, we'll go ahead and put the VGA in here, make sure it, it does work to make sure this posts. I don't know what else I would do to fix a GPU. We have a post and like I said, it looks like we have no issues. For the sake of testing, even though we are getting a white error, I'm just gonna look over, clean the contacts on the H on the on this other GPU and see if we can find some way to make it work. So let's try that real quick and then if not then we'll we'll call it dead and know that we've basically fixed the issue. Maybe there's something that is keeping it from making contact. Because I know this is under warranty still, I'm not gonna do more than that at that point in time. My recommendation at this point is just to RMA it and then to get it fixed. So, but we're gonna try little things that we can do just to see if we can get an image per chance. So, oh, there's that white light. Yeah, definitely hitting a VGA issue. One more time, we're gonna try the other uh, plug. Yeah, right to, that, right to that VGA. Something is definitely damaged or broken about this this particular GPU. We are going to uh, go ahead and RMA his graphics card um, because everything else looks like it works absolutely fine. So it's literally just a dead graphics card. So can I fix it? No, I can't because I need to go get this fixed. So uh, we will come back We're, with the magic of YouTube. This will happen in instance. We have an RMA RTX 3070 Ti. We are going to pop that in here because we believe that is the problem. All the troubleshooting points are there. We've done all of the appropriate testing, which I think you would agree. So we're gonna go in there, make sure this works. And if it does, then hey, I fixed it. If not, then I am lame and then we will diagnose more. So here we go. Let's pop this in and get this installed. So. It's so pretty and white. It's so beautiful today. Now let's go make it right. That was good, I was, I'm freaking best music person ever. Boom. Okay, there it is. Let's see if this fixes the problem. Okay, it's on, it's on. We're on. Question is, 
Are we gonna get a post is the question. Look at that. Still waiting. And there we go. We are in to Windows. It is posted. We are good to go, problem solved. What did you guys think of the video? I mean, again, did you like the way that I diagnosed the problem? I'd love to know your feedback on all this. I've seen Greg Salazar getting to do these videos and I like problem solving. And so, you know what, I figured, hey, I got this one. Why not do more? So if you are in the Seattle area or heck, uh, if you are someplace where you have a physical hardware issue uh, and you'd love to see if we can uh, try and fix it on the show, just remember, we're not guaranteeing that we're gonna fix it. Uh, we're not guaranteeing that we're gonna replace your parts. Again, we're just gonna try and diagnose and figure out what's actually going on. This has to be hardware, it can't be software or anything like that. Uh, reach out to us, business at rubytech.com. Uh, we'll work out with you and uh, see if it's something you can do. Now, if you are gonna ship it, you're gonna cover shipping. Uh, I have no issue with that. And of course, we don't deal with anything if uh, something gets break. So better, if you're in the local Seattle area, we'd love to take a look at your machine and try and see if we can uh, solve issues like this. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, I loved getting to do it and solving out what the issue was. Um, you know, luckily it was something we were able to fix and solve. Um, I will let you guys know later, uh, probably via Twitter, or whatever it was, uh, if we can find out what actually happened to the other GPU because there was like no physical damage or anything like that. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, again, you can follow me on socials at RobyTech absolutely everywhere. I uh, hope you enjoyed the show and we look forward to seeing you on the next one. Thank you.